congratulations for being back here at San Diego Comic Con. How Thank does you. it feel? Yeah, no, it's great to be back. Um, these are my people. I love it. I love being here. I love hanging out with all the all the freaks, which I am one of them. So um, yeah, I'm very happy to be back. It's been you know two and a half years. We did kind of remote stuff to kind of promote the show, but here it's uh, it's the real thing. So I'm happy to be here. Now, of course, this year is a little bit different because, you know, the pandemic kind of slowed a few things. But what did you bring to the table for the fans this year around? Um, I have a bunch of, I mean, as far as uh, stuff, I have a bunch of shirts and things I'm going to throw out to the audience when they give a good question. Um, but, you know, we're just going to talk about the show. You know, we're talking about the second half of season, in my mind, 16, even though... American Dad's uh, how it ranks as far as how many seasons we go is insane. But uh, yeah, we're going to do the second half of uh, promote the 14 episodes that we have, which are lots of fun. And after this, we have another two seasons to go, which have already been picked up. So there's a lot of uh, fun still to be had. So what's some of the uh, favorite episodes that we should be uh, looking out for? All of them. Uh, yeah, <laughs> exactly. All of them. There's a, there's a new Wheels in the Leg Man. Uh, you know, right here, and uh, we have a, we're going to have a multiverse episode, you have a metaverse episode, we have uh, another uh, Christmas episode where Roger becomes the Grinch, um, but but um, he has, yeah, I'm not going to, that's all I'll say about that. Um, we have, uh, you know, one where the family ends up on a on an island and forgets who they are completely and questions humanity and what it means to be human and the need for clothes. Um, and you know, we're, there's a there's a bunch of things that you guys are not ready for, and uh, I think you'll be happy about that. Now, 16 years and an additional two years—that's a lot of years. What's the secret to success for America? Uh, luck. Yeah, and mostly, you know, I mean, what the secret of success, I don't even have, I don't, can't uh, really, just believing in what you're doing, mm -hmm. I guess. You know, uh, I've always felt like um, there are going to be a lot of people who are going to tell you what you should do, and if you just kind of listen, kind of try to block that out if you can, and just listen to the voices that you trust, whether it be the other creatives or your own, you know, inside little tiny voice, uh, listen to that as much as possible, you're better off. Than all these people who are like, oh, you got the show's got to be like this, the show's got to be like that, and nobody really knows. Only they, the only thing that they do know is that they want to be successful. So that has to be defined by you. Do you consider this show a success? Of course it is. I, I, I think at this point that we have to consider it a success. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I was, I was happy for season two. I remember way back when, like, oh my gosh, this is so great. We got a second season, and now here we are. It's uh, you know that many years later and that many more gray hairs later and uh, it's been it's been really fun and um, really a magical experience and um, I'm loving it I'm still loving it after all this time which I'm very grateful for well I'm happy for it thank you for uh, 16 years plus another two years and hopefully another 16 yeah I appreciate that thank you all for watching thank you